Hello and welcome once again to the Rugged Rockhound. Today I'm once again joined with my dad and we're here back at the Levan Black Agate. So the hill over there is we've been finding where the zone was where we found our black agate. And last time I was here, we found some ragged agate on a smaller hill just over there. So today we are going back to the red agate and this time we're gonna actually dig into the hill in the places where we were finding it to see if we can find some even better stuff. So wish us luck. So last time we were here, that's where we started finding the red. It's all along the right side of this hill. So just kind of following the right side of it. And that's the hill with the black agate. That over there is the old pit. And last time I was here, I was up there and I slipped and fell. No, it was right over there. I see the first piece of the day. It's a nice orange one. Look at that. Got it glow. Basically a carnelian. It's so cool. I see another piece right here. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that would be a lot bigger than I think. Grab the hand pick. There we go. I just realized I forgot the spray bottles. Dang it. Oh. Oh, no. That's unfortunate. I'll have to spray these off afterward. That'll work just fine though. I'll show the piece like this and then I'll show it sprayed off afterwards. So it's got orange right in the middle, but the rest of it's mostly calcite, looks like. Another orange one right there. Nice little orange ones here and there. Ooh, that's a darker one right there. That looks nice. Ooh, let's see, right here, looks like a pretty decent one too. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. That one's not very good. Dad just found a few over here. That's a nice looking one. And that looks really nice. That one should be beautiful once it's washed off. Add those to the bucket. Just pulled that one out. That one should be nice cleaned off. That looks like a decent piece. Oh yeah. Color this mostly. Well, that one looks pretty nice. Still small. I've got lots of small ones, just tons of small ones. So my dad's been digging a little bit just to see if he can find anything. He's pulled out some chunks that definitely have calcite and you can see little veins going through it right there. And then he pulled that one out. That looks pretty nice. Just picked up a larger color, this one. And then this looks really good right here. Oh yes, there's a good one. Clean that off a little bit. Oh yeah, look at that. That'll be really nice once I clean that off. Okay, that's the best piece we've found so far today. Last time we were here, the really good botryoidal pieces that we found, I believe uh, my dad found the first good one right in here the big one, and then I found the other half of it up there. Then I found a different one, I think, over here. So right in this area, and just down below me, I found these. That one looks like kind of a black agate, and that one. I'll have to get them cleaned off to see how good they actually are. All right, trying to find out exactly where it's coming out. I walked, I worked my way up, and right there I found a piece coming out, and then a couple down here. I think I found one little thing up there, but it looks like right through there is where it's coming out. And let me show you what it was. <laughs> I can get it. It's that piece right there. So you got that darker stuff, the agate right in the middle of all that calcite. I also found a few pieces I need to clean up and see if they've got anything in them. This one had some black on it. Once again, that was right in this area. So yeah, I think that's where we're gonna wanna dig. Here's this one cut open. Not too bad, it's got some agar right in the middle. Lots of calcite, once again. But definitely some agar in there. So here we got this nice zone of calcite. So I walked around, and if you follow the line of where the orange is, the calcite layer comes across here, hits here, and then it goes right in line where we found that other stuff there. And look at that. Got some of the botryoidal right there. 
Just a thin layer on top of the calcite, but it's something. So my dad's been busting up the rocks and there was that one that had a little on it and look what else, look what it had in it. So there it was on the outside. Look at that pocket there and then look in there. That is so cool. On the other side of it, right there. Look at that. Black on the outside, red on the inside. So right there, I just picked this up. Let me show you this. This looks like a good piece. It's got stuff going through it. Very nice. Here's this one. Definitely one of the best pieces. Look at all that red going through it. And then the white in the middle. That's just so beautiful. I'd love to see what more is in it, but I'm so worried about it fracturing. You can already see where pieces are trying to come off. But boy, is that beautiful on that side. So we, we've been finding just a few things, not a whole lot on the hill. I've been just kind of collecting the stuff on the, the side that's washed down. Mostly the little stuff, but I did find this one. So that's a decent looking one. But yeah, most of it's been little stuff. And it's just been kind of laying on the surface all over. Oh, like that one, for example. Yeah, little pieces like that all over. Here's this one washed off. That's a good one. Oh, is that a dark one? Oh, it does look like it's a dark one. Yeah, very dark. Here's this one cleaned off. It's really nice. Sorry about the neighbors, they're a little noisy. So yeah, nice. So right there, just pulled that out. Look at that. That looks like it's pretty decent. That should be really nice. Here's this one washed off. This one's interesting because it's a lot of agate in very small veins through the rock. On that side. Cool. Under this tree, just pulled that thing out. That'll probably look really nice. We'll get that cleaned off. Here's this one washed off. Got some nice crystals right in the middle. And these ones are actually quartz, not calcite. Unusual, mostly it's calcite up here. And a little bit of agate. Just caught back up with my dad. He's been digging here for a while and look what he uncovered. Look at that thing. That'll be exciting to wash off. Yeah, we'll have to get that cleaned off and other pieces of it. Yeah, this could be really good. We're gonna have to wash all this off. Oh yeah, that looks really good. This was a big one my dad found. And look at this vein. It's hiding behind this thin layer of calcite. So I'll have to try and get that cleaned off, but boy, you can already see just how good that's gonna be when I get that all cleaned off. Look at that, beautiful. And if I flip it over on this side, boy, it continues. Look at that. Pocket of calcite down here too. What a rock. Look at that agate. He's just handing me another handful. Let's see what we got here. Tiny bit right there. Oh, there's a little there. Oh, what does he pull out here? Oh, maybe, maybe. Here's one of the little pieces cut open and it just shattered. And this is one of the most solid ones I could find and it just absolutely shattered. So the rest of the ones we pull out, all that, that stuff we're pulling out of the ground, it's probably gonna be so fractured I'm probably gonna avoid cutting it. There, I'd go dropping one. So, uh, we'll see, but this is probably the only one I'm even going to attempt cutting. Here's this one washed off. So sometimes it's covered in this thin layer of calcite, and you can't really see all of it. So I'm going to have to see about cleaning that off. But you can just see it's really good agate. So my dad has found a vein that is going down there. We're getting a bunch of pieces out. Don't know how good they are until we get them cleaned off. But... The vein, you can see a little piece just coming out right there. It's just all here going down. See, look at that. Those little shards. So, get down, see if we can get down deep enough to get past where it's been breaking up from freeze thaw. 
There's this one washed off. Nice. Here's this one washed off. Some nice red veins going through this one. Here's this one washed off. This one had some really nice color and patterns. Yeah, mostly that side. Here's this one washed off. Nice vein. Here's this one washed off. You can see the cracks in it. This stuff is so fractured. Here's this one washed off. Very nice. So nice. There's this one washed off. Some thicker veins right there. It'll be nice to get all this stuff polished eventually. Here's this one washed off. Mostly it's on this side. Not much there. Is this one washed off? This one was more orange, not so much red, and quite a bit of calcite. Here's this one washed off. Once again, a bunch of smaller veins going through it. But you can see, nice stuff. Here's this one washed off. Very nice. Ah, I wonder what's right under this, huh? We'll have to get in there. Could be really nice right under that. Here's this one washed off. Got a cool zigzag of it going through. But boy, you can see how fractured that is. So fractured. So here we have another nice one. So some of these bigger pieces have some nice veins in them. Some of them didn't. <laughs> Just pulled the top off, which was already fractured, and look at this chunk. I can see veins going through it. Can't see them very well yet until we wash it off. But it's looking good. So this big piece had a few veins in a few different places. So this one is really nice here. A lot of calcite. Not really anything on this side. But right over here, you had a nice chunk of it. That was agate. Just this piece right there. This is the location where I took the spill the other day. Don't know how well you can see, but all of that torn, tore it all the way down to the muscle. <laughs> yeah. So apparently we lost a piece when I did that. So we're going to see if I can't find it. <laughs> yeah, this is very slick right here. So yeah, I fell on that and that's what tore my hand. Anyway, it was slipped and the bucket spilled right here. So I'm gonna search down, see what I can find. That's it. There it is, <laughs> that piece we lost. That's why I didn't see it, because it landed like that and it looked like a regular rock. Thank goodness I found it. So after finding the piece over there, I decided to walk around and just see if I could see any black pieces up on the field here above the pit. And I found a few. In particular, that one looks really cool. Very nice. What we need to do is come back here in the winter when all the grass is dead. That way we can actually see the ground. We made it back to the vehicle. There's our full bucket, a whole bunch of good stuff. You guys have already seen it all cut open and washed off. I don't know. It's very dirty, so I can't tell from here. I don't know how good it's going to be. It could be just okay. It could be really good. You guys already know, so hopefully it was amazing. Until next time, remember, there is treasure everywhere.